Hello, welcome to Shanti Road. This time in Mumbai. I came to this city two days ago. There was a holy festival which I was so busy. I will explain about what's going on in Holi. Uh, they drink some kind of drinks, some kind of lassi, uh, which has a weed inside it, like cannabis. And uh, it's a normal thing, everyone is drinking it here. And uh, I was somewhere last night, yesterday, I mean, for Holi party. And they make this and they gave it to everyone. So everyone drank it. It was so delicious and tasty. And we didn't have any idea what is it. And then we got high, <laughs> so high, which I couldn't. So the last video didn't record fully. So we got so high and we just chilled in the hostel and we didn't go anywhere because we couldn't move that much. <laughs> and uh, today is, uh, I mean, last day I couldn't record any video. I even couldn't bring out my camera because we were high. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I just chilled with other people, with uh, uh, all the Indian people that I knew. And then, uh, Yes, I slept really good, <laughs> really, really good, deep and long time. And no, uh, I'm not hangover. <laughs> I just wake up and I'm going to explore this amazing city of Mumbai. I'm so excited for Mumbai, so, so excited because I know how strange and beautiful is this city. So I'm going to visit a few places today, maybe more than a few places and some markets for sure. I need to buy some stuff also, so I will go to the local markets of Mumbai and I try to explain as much as I can about here. Be with me! So, nothing is clear in India. <laughs> it's 30 minutes I'm walking to reach to this place, uh, which is Tower of Silence. It's a Zarathustrian people place and I really wanted to visit it but there is two doors, both of them are closed there is no one to ask anything it's just like a jungle behind me so yeah you really need a tour guide for India <laughs> So I came for breakfast and I have the biggest masala dosa that I ordered now like this to reach there and now I have my local guy Sharon which is behind me and he's so busy but he is helping me to find some places around and see it's actually so wide I didn't know this wild it is. Ladies, gate, no? Yes. Yeah, it's mask. They should be separate. Yeah. Is it old? It's very old. It's. Uh, I think, I think it's 16th, uh, maybe 16th century or 17th century okay. and the story goes yeah.
so as you see behind me it's just people uh, the ones that they are begging the ones that they are homeless sometimes and uh, some people that they want to eat and there is no beauty in my eyes actually um, so i'm leaving this place uh, yeah in a fight <laughs> Bazaar? No, it's laundry, it's washing clothes. Laundry, oh. Ho, 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 ho. White cloth. It's 24/7 by the government. Now, when we have our monsoon season, that's from June to August, mid-September, that time most of the people who are living here. I found something really interesting uh, so its name is Fashion Street and there is an street which I miss I'm in it and uh, other side which I will show you right now is a big market and it's a fashion market let's see what I can find Lot. I cannot do shopping. They ask a lot, talk a lot to me. <laughs> <laughs> And they don't do it because I'm foreigner. They do it for everyone. Like all the people that they are passing here, they make them uncomfortable to come to their shop and buy something. It's a little bit hard, but it's the way. So, Mumbai is so different with what I was expecting. I spent whole day walking in the streets of South Mumbai. And uh, now I'm walking for finding a yellow, for finding a place for sunset. Why did I oh. <laughs> Okay, we call, we call. So I came to find a place for sunset, which I saw in the map, which is a nice place. But there is even not one tiny point to sit. Unlimited number of people you can find here. Unlimited. 